So this is for the bad bong song. Bad, bad bong. <sighs> That's a bad bong. This is for the bad bond song book. And uh, it was it was devised when I came through here and played with this band, Chelsea Light Moving, which is a band I put together with uh, John Maloney and Samara Lebelski and Keith Wood. And we were uh, barnstorming around Europe, and uh, we were Chelsea Light Moving. And we played here, and we had a, uh, an album full of songs, and one of them was called No Go. And, but it was um, never on any album. It was never on any. Really it was never on the album. It was, it was never only released. one album. It's actually a secret song. It's an unreleased song, but it's but it it it, it, it exists here as a game, because it is kind of a game called No Go. Um, at least on this piece of paper, it is. And uh, to me, No Go was a you know, it was kind of a, a bit of a protest song. It was a, it was a commentary on activism and and, and protest. Um, it's a bit of a loaded song, and. Uh, the idea of say what you will, stay where you are, and like no, 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 no. It was like idea of defiance, but it was also also idea of was like breaking through the barriers, the the borders. It was like no borders, no go. Um, it, usually, but, you're like a yes person. Usually, I am a yes person. He's a yes person. Yeah. So the idea that you would be saying like no, no, it was really like this moment where he was just like, yeah, I I've just decided to say no. Yeah. And. I think that there was even talk of doing like a music video at some point with uh, children who just just refused, you know, like refuse nicks. Yeah. And uh, so the game, you have to explain the game because Eva, when we were we were here, uh, Eva was here with us, and she wrote this game. She made well, this game. I was also with my two-year-old daughter. And her two-year-old daughter was here, so that was very inspirational. Um, so maybe you should describe explain. What is going on with the system here? Do you remember? No. <laughs> oh, no go. Well, it starts, a lot of the, you know, um, the end of the song is like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, no! No, go! So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't think, I think basically what it is, it's just, um, it's a really sort of uh, e expressionist page for your for your book <laughs> and it was all about the action of the song being in the book and our, our feeling being here and um, you know Chelsea light moving I mean when we were here it was just like it was the sky was full of stars shooting stars shooting stars there was lots of shooting stars and so in a way we felt like this was kind of the best gig Chelsea light moving was here it was just like because it was definitely some lights moving <laughs> in the sky and uh, it was really central for us. And so yeah, it was also like a point when we, everyone was at a point in their life where they just decided they knew everything that they were supposed to be doing and everything that everybody else wanted them to be doing, and just finally saying no, <laughs> but I want to do something else. Yeah, that's what it is. And that's what it remains. And I, I, I had sort of forgotten about this until you showed it to me. <laughs> I mean, it's great that you remembered it. So I'm really happy that this is in the book. Maybe you, you know? should release the song specifically <laughs> for yeah, this because it doesn't exist anywhere. Should we put a flexi disc in the book? Yeah.